welcome back to another beach camp on the east coast we've got some absolutely beautiful weather now it's meant to be 40 mile an hour gusts so this is the spot for that westerly wind walking down the beach wasn't too bad though it was a little blustery but it is a lot of wind chill in that in that wind it is actually meant to get down to zero tonight but we'll see but yeah magical place so today going with a light wave g15 range again as it's a great freestanding shelter at only 1.5 kilos and i've gone with a mat to stop the sun getting in i've got my full winter set up looking at the x firm the e10 I did bring the heavier pack, the Seek Outside Divide, but I could make the whole system a bit about 600 grams lighter if I brought the Z Packs Arc Blast, but I can't complain. 3.6 kilos for the big three. Yeah, definitely works for me, especially when we're only walking four or five miles down the beach. And Phil, he's in his Lightwave G20, which is his ultimate beach shelter. Uh, got a little repair, but what's its weight? Uh, 2.3 kilos. Not bad for a two man geodesic tent. Proper two man and kit as well. So, yeah. But, yeah, some stunning weather. I'm very happy with this. Should have a nice night. It beats 50 mile an hour winds on the top of the hills. But, yes, I think it's time to see what grub we've got today. So, I've got the stove on the go. Uh, I'm not actually cooking anything, I'm actually doing a brew at the minute, nice cup of coffee. So today, I'm trying something new, we've got kimchi, which is a Chinese uh, fermented cabbage, it's quite spicy apparently, and a nice big tub of chicken, should be nice, beats cooking all the time, so stove will be getting used quite a bit tonight I reckon, doing brews, but yeah, looking forward to that. Oh yeah, I think it's time to shut up and eat and see you in the morning as always. sleep so I'll get a nice brew on the go so not to mention a couple of new bits of kit I've got the the ultralight folding table by Cascade Wild which I'm glad to have nice and ultralight and also the Kestrel 2000 windometer and anemeter uh, yeah, it's basically, I thought we were being 40 mile an hour gust, get it to try it out, but Weatherman got it wrong, so about 20 in max. But yes, I think it's time to get a nice cup of coffee, have my breakfast, which is a, a Grey's chocolate cookie. Hey, see you when the sun comes up. Beautiful, absolutely magical that. Cracking sunrise, just above the clouds. I hope you can hear me because it's been gusting at around 25 with a constant 20 mile an hour wind. The temperatures are alright, they're around 7 degrees but 2 in the, the wind chill. I 
I've got me front in. If ever like windproof on, does the job. Look at that. That's why we camp at these spots to get these views. Only got about three hours in total, but I'm happy.